It's amazing when you look at so many of the scholars and their opinions about the accuracy of the transmission of the scriptures and their datings and all. Uh, a number of them were very contrary uh, to the conclusions that it's reliable, it's trustworthy, or early dating. But so many of them, when they would examine it, would change their opinion. For example, uh, Robinson, who was a lecturer at Trinity College in Cambridge, he accepted the consensus that the New Testament was written way later into the second century. And he, he thought that was a scholarly conclusion. But as little more than actually in his own words, as a theological joke, just to make a joke of it, he decided to investigate the arguments of the dating of all the books of the New Testament. And to his amazement and to his honesty, and I want to read this, he said, the results stunned me. Owing to scholar sloppy, scholarly sloppiness, the tyranny of unexamined assumption and the almost willful blindness by previous authors. He went on to say, much of the past reasoning was untenable. And he concluded that the New Testament, now here's one of the greatest liberals saying it was written way in the second century. He concluded the New Testament is a work of the apostles themselves or of contemporaries who worked with them. And he concluded that every single book of the New Testament was written before 70 A.D. Folks, it is trustworthy. Millar Burroughs of Yale University said, Another result of comparing New Testament Greek with the language of the papyri is an increase of confidence in the accurate transmission of the text of the New Testament itself. The text has been transmitted with remarkable fidelity. He went on to say, so there need be no doubt whatever regarding the teachings conveyed by them. And Dr. Howard Vaus um, made this statement. The case for the reliability of the New Testament is infinitely stronger than that for any other record of antiquity. Dr. Voss's conclusion is the same conclusion I came to after trying to refute it all. That if I could not trust the New Testament, then I'd have to throw out all literature of antiquity and become a total historic agnostic.